This is Patrick Sebil. We are on the Band of Anglers booth at ICAS 2019. This time I want to introduce to you the Curly Min from Hyperlastics. The Curly Min. Well, that's a curly tail. Yeah, obviously. And you've seen many curly tails, I'm sure, in the past. But that guy have a curly tail, have a minnow body. And the way I set and balance it using the soft tough material allows me for new kind of actions. I hope you're going to love this. That's a six inch. I plan to come also with a five and a four and an eight. Basically enough to cover bass, smallmouth, trout, salmon, walleye, muskie, pike. So big range. Let's start with the swim bait model that have a weighted white gap hook. What's unique is not only we have the action from the tail, which is a curly tail obviously, but the specific body with the specific material adds more action to the lure. Let's see in the water now. So what you've seen is not only the curly tail of that typical curly tail and great action behind the lure, but the body itself have a side to side motion like a build minnow. And, and that's really that balance, the shape, the balance of the, the hook, the position of the weight, as well as that material, which is buoyant. Material is pure end, so if you fish for pike or for bass, and sometimes you want to make those balls on bottom, is what happened. That's what you can do. <laughs> so that's really interesting, but I think what you're gonna see, uh, I believe you've never seen that before. I believe so. I do. I'm gonna tie now the top water mod model, floating with a white gap hook not weighted. Let's see what we can do with this in the water. So thanks to that, now you have a great action on the top. Thank, thanks to this lure, as you see now, we have that floating body, we have that rolling motion, we have the, the tail that's working behind, so it's perfect if you want to fish in the lily pads, for example, targeting pike or bass, fishing in very shallow water. You also can use this with a Carolina rig, so you can have that action but down deep. Having your leader, you know, say two feet, three feet long leader, and then your weight, so now you know you can fish deep when it's needed. If you have small mouth bass, for example, and you want to reach those guys 30, 40 feet deep, 50 feet deep, you can fish effectively with a lure that have a really great action but having the lure above the bottom even in deep water so that's the curly mean that's i believe one of my best baits to come <laughs> 